Hello. Let's talk about energy and waves. So what is energy and waves? All waves propagate by exchanging energy between two forms. For water and elastic strings, the exchange is between the potential and kinetic energy. You can see here the direction of energy wave where you can find a spring which is moving up and down. So this is the waveform where it is actually having an energy level. You can find the difference in the spring over here. Apart from this, for the sound waves, the energy oscillates between pressure and kinetic energy. Whereas in terms of light waves, the energy oscillates between electric and magnetic field. You can see some visible right example for the energy and waves. The red wave, the orange, the yellow, the green and blue. You can find the difference of how the energy level varies for each waves which is represented in different color formats. We shall see about describing waves. Standing waves have nodes and antinodes. You can see here the nodes and antinodes. A node is a point where the string stays at its equilibrium position. Whereas an antinode is a point where the wave is as far as it gets from equilibrium. So if you see over here, the green color point is mentioning about the node whereas the red point is emphasizing about the antinode. So the distance between a node and the antinode next to it is lambda divided by 4. Let's talk about describing waves. A mode is a category of types of wave behavior. One mode of the vibrating string is a rotating wave and the other mode is a transverse wave. Because of the reason that a vertical vibrating string moves in circles. The wave looks the same from the front and from the side. This is how the waves used to describe in various categories. You can see here how the waves are described. Let us see about standing waves in 2D and 3D. Most of the vibrating objects have more complex shapes than a string. Complex shapes create more waves as an object can vibrate. Two and three dimensional objects tend to have two or three families of modes. You can see some example of standing waves in 2D. Let's talk about the applications. One such example is microwave ovens. Microwaves are a form of electromagnetic radiation with wavelengths ranging from as long as 1 meter to as short as 1 millimeter. You can see the application of microwave oven how it is getting to be having the wavelength. Hope you understood. Thank you for watching this from GTEC.